Welcome to the Much Better Than Free Inventors Expo. Last year, it was the Better Than Free Inventors Expo because every registered attendee, exhibitor, and pitch event contestant had a chance at winning monetary prizes. This is also the case this year. So what could possibly be much better than that? Well, a $1,000 giveaway of services by one of our exhibitors, Prototype House. But wait, there's more. Both of our speakers are major product scouts. Gary Sullivan of All Star Innovations, one of the most reputable and inventor-friendly companies in the as seen on TV industry, gave us a backstage look at what works and why, as well as how to get into the industry. There is just no other venue that can easily match inventors and entrepreneurs to serious money. All Star knows what to look for in a product and is committed to making that happen. There were several other blankets with sleeves that failed miserably before All Star brought out the Snuggie that we all love and cherish. Check them out at allstarmg.com. Kelly Oliver, a 25-year home shopping network veteran for which she has been a top-ranked host on HSN and QVC and a product scout. She shared the secrets of what it takes to be a success in the business and why we still need to use the venue in today's omni-platform world. Kelly is also a successful inventor. Her beauty and healthcare products are flying off the shelves. You'd know why if you saw the before and after photos on her website. Go visit it at www.kellyoliver.com. That's www.k-e-l-l-i-e-o-l-v-e-r.com. Hmm, major product scouts at an Inventors Expo? That very well could be a recipe for making money in 2020. Let's go see what's gonna happen. We're here with Matt from Prototype House. Matt, so good to have you here today. Thank you for having me. So tell us a little bit about what your company does. So Prototype House is a full service product development firm. We help inventors, entrepreneurs, and small startups from initial concepts through 3D CAD engineering, prototyping, packaging, all the way up to manufacturing. Um, and sourcing and we also help with some product placement as well. You're a very good friend to have because you could be an inventor but you might not know how to get your product to the next step but that's where you come in. Absolutely. Well I hope everybody enjoys the show. Come check us out prototypehouse.com. We have a beautiful office here in Miami as well as here in Broward. Come check us out and uh, follow us on Instagram. Thanks Perfect. for stopping by. Well like Matt said what all you have to do is bring in those napkins to Prototype House and they take you from there. So thanks Matt. You're welcome. Thank you. All right, so tell me a little bit about your product here. Yes, so Dignity is a party game for risque folk. So we have three different versions of Dignity. Okay. Dignity is an actual deck of cards. You can essentially play poker with them, any other card game, or you can play by our rules, which means every card has something different printed on it. So there are different actions, challenges, and mini games. There are things that you're doing with each other, for each other, or even to each other. So you take a drink, you place it at the center of the table with the cards face down. The youngest person of the group goes first. Now we recommend you play with four to ten players. Um, no more than ten because then you start losing attention spans. But the youngest person goes first. You pick a card, you read it out loud, and you have to do what it says. Okay. If for whatever reason it's a little too scandalous and you don't want to do what it says, then you take a sip of your own drink, you place it on top of the cup, and the next person goes. And you keep going until there's no more cards, or the top of the cards somehow tip off. If that happens, that drink is now yours, you replace it for the next victim, and you can either put the cards back in play or you can remove them. And so we have three different versions. We have the more risque version, which is our Proto. We have the Icebreaker 2.0, which is more couple friendly, because when we launched, people either requested a very scandalous one, or a more inclusive one. So I decided to go more inclusive first. Perfect, I have a feeling everyone from the event is gonna end up here somehow. <laughs> I'm free, hopefully, that would be awesome. Thank you for your time, it's a great product. I appreciate it, thank you. We're here with Freddie with Flip Top Table. So Freddie, tell me how this works. Okay, this is very easy. It is a table that actually fits on any piece of furniture, even a car. What it does is that all you have to do is adjust it to the height as required. And to take it out is very simple. You just pull it out like that. And it is adjustable here with the holes. Now all you have to do is hold it here like this, push it in, and you have a table. Okay?
So any furniture to a freestanding table. Freestanding table. That's all you have to do. Perfect. Freddie, this is great. Thank you so much. You're welcome. So tell me about this beautiful product I'm looking at here. Okay. Our innovation is a silver mirror that yes. has the silver removed around this area. We can place a logo behind it and backlight it. So without the backlight, it looks like this. And with the backlight, it looks like that. And can you do any logo? Like any, any person? Any logo, any irregular shape, whatever. The improvement on that one, or the second model, was that one you see at the end there. Yes. That has the logo at the end, but now we added a 15-inch player capable of showing 1,000 images. So it becomes an advertising. I was just going to say, that's for advertising, but you could also use any of these as a gift, a birthday, something exactly. like that? Exactly. Okay. Here we have this custom gift here. You send us the image, whatever you want. You have a friend with a boat, just like this one. The price point on these units, these two are $99 retail, and that one is $199. Really creative products. Much luck to you. I think Thank you're going to you. do well. Thank you very much. Reuse pack. So tell me a little bit about it. Reuse pack. We aim to be alternative to cardboard boxes. Okay. Every year, 100 billion cardboard boxes are produced and used in the United States alone. And it's a big waste on the cardboard box and the natural resources. So what we do is invent, develop, and selling the products to be the reusable alternative to cardboard boxes. Doing good and saving money. We both like that. Thank you so much for your time. Appreciate it. Thank you. All right, our next incredible in product is Spraymo. So tell me a little bit about it. So this is called the Spraymo Home Plus Garden Spray Bottle. Okay. And it's 10 times less work than those traditional spray bottles. Just a couple pumps, one, two. Look at that. Wow. No more tired, cramped hands. No batteries to replace. Right Just if you have carpal tunnel syndrome, anything exactly. like that. Exactly. Right? Patented efficient use of physics. It sprays at those convenient angles. Oh, look at that. Fully adjustable nozzle. Okay. Look at that. It just goes and goes. I like that. It You're helping us clean. Exactly. And it empties the entire bottle, leaving no waste. It's durable, it's sustainable, it's built for years of use because it has no moving pistons to wear out. Definitely different than anything I've seen on the market. So very good job. Thank you. I like it. We're here with another incredible product, Simply Cover. So tell me a little bit about Simply Cover. Hi, my name is Lee Newman with Simply Cover. We came up with a device that hides your electrical outlet when you spend thousands of dollars on tiling your backsplash. Why do you want to look at this when you can look at this? So when you're ready to use your outlet, you pull out the device and you Put it back in when you're all done, and it camouflages that outlet. Simple. I love this. It's so simple, but brilliant. Why did we not think of this before? We needed you. We needed me. <laughs> Great product. Thank, Thank you. Thank you very much. Our next creative product is Boxer Ball. So tell me about Boxer Ball. Okay, we have a piece here that's great for sports and fitness. It's great for the uh, men, women, and kids. We have a whole demo group for kids when we go with the lighter ball, and we have the... Uh, full boxing glove and the MMA style glove. So we have any and all gloves with any and all balls. The heavier the ball, the more of the power punch. Right now, title boxing is looking at it with the uh, tether ball that we have with boxer ball. And uh, we're here showing you the different ways we can do it. So it's for training, exercise, but also a lot of fun. It's for kids, it's for men, women, and children. Like you say, it's all about fun. Perfect, I like it. All right, now show me. I want to see how this works. Get to exercising. <laughs> Look at him go. <laughs> She's doing it back there too. Great product. Don't get this man mad at you, that's for sure. <laughs> Look at it. Great exercise. No, he's not a chef. This is Queenie Cap. So tell me about Queenie Cap. Hi, my name is Brian. I'm with Queenie Cap. Queenie Cap is the only shower cap that allows a woman with long hair to wash as much or little of their hair as they want to while keeping the remainder of it dry. Okay. And the reason you want to do that is because on those in-between days between full washes, a lot of women start getting a little greasy around the top or the main of their hair. So what this allows you to do is basically, like a normal shower cap, you put it on, just pull through the hair that's dirty, wash it in the shower like you would during your normal routine, then all you do is pull it off, and then what happens is you have just this piece of, of your hair that's wet, if you dry this off and style it and you're ready to go, it's going to save you product and most importantly time during your normal washing routine. Saving time and money and looking good at the same time. Absolutely. Great product. Thank 
Thank you. All right, so tell me a little bit about the product you have here. Well, this is a reconfigurable implement handle to provide the best ergonomic uh, configuration uh, for, for any given implement. Uh, the implement I have here is a hunting knife, but it could be used for a garden trowel, an industrial tool. The concept is that everybody's hand is the same, yet everybody's hand is different. So the concept here is that you could have a, a handle, you could put finger grooves in it, you could make it straight, and if you don't like it, take it apart. Take all these little segments out and reconfigure it to the way you want. You, you could uh, get the feel of it, and you could also use it for a while. So there's an opportunity to keep reconfiguring the handle to get the most optimal ergonomics. Perfect. Okay, well, thank you so much. Appreciate it. Paver Claw is our next creative product, so tell us a little about Paver Claw. I designed Paver Claw because I had a mole get under my pool deck and sink a bunch of the pavers down. And when I tried to get them out with a screwdriver, I chipped the edges and my wife said, stop, right there. <laughs> so I invented this tool and it's made out of stainless spring steel. It's made right here in Florida and it's designed to slip between the pavers and lock underneath them so that it applies the lifting force to the underside of the paver, which is a lot easier than trying to pry pavers out from the top using putty knives, Got it. which is what most people try to do, right, and it right. doesn't work well. So you tap this down between the pavers, it expands and locks underneath, and then you can simply lift it out. Look at that. Now this is a dis uh, you know, concept. Right. If, if you have you know, real pavers in your driveway, there's right. sand in there, you might need to use a putty knife to get that sand out before you can get the claw to go in. And then you'll need to probably tap around the edge of the paver as you're lifting it to get the uh, stiction broken. There's a uh, resistance to getting pulled out that's there from the pressure on the sides and whatever. But the easiest thing to do is tap around the paver and lift with the handle. That comes with it. And as you tap, the, the friction is broken Incredible. and the paver, paver lifts out little by little. You can't pull it out all at once. Nobody's that strong. No, but I love it because you had a problem, but you found a way around it. I love that. And these are available on Amazon. Just look, just search for paver claw. Very creative. Good job. Thank much success. Thank you. Thank you very much. So tell me a little bit about how your product works. Okay, my, uh, my invention's a locking mailbox. Most mail, locking mailboxes don't have an outgoing mail compartment, and this has an outgoing mail compartment where the mailman can pick up his mail, the mail that you're sending out from a compartment here, or he delivers your mail and it drops into a lock compartment that's in back, away from the road. Nice, so you don't have to step in the road to get your mail. Exactly, and you'd have a combination lock here so you don't have to carry a key to get your mail. Perfect. And you uh, open up the door. Again, you're away from the traffic and you access the mail through Very the back. Very safe. In today's society, this is a definite yes. Absolutely, yes. thank you. Good job. Thank you. We're here with Will Smith today. So Will Smith, tell me what you got here. I am happy to present the world's first smart helmet with built-in turn signals, right and left turn signals, as well as four-way emergency flashes. Also, along with that, we also produce a vest, which also has the right and left turn signals, as well as four-way emergency flashers. I'm glad to do it. The objective, I want to see lives saved. And I think you're going to do that. Thank you. Florida leads the nation in motorcycles deaths, so I agree. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. The Inventure Society of South Florida is a 501c3 nonprofit organization dedicated to the advancement of the independent inventor through the use of education, motivation, and collaborative support. Don't be fooled by people and companies making it look like it's a get-rich scheme. It takes a lot of work. They don't do the work for you, but they do give you the tools to get the job done. There are tons of rules that change all the time. How can you get started or move forward with your own projects? Come to their monthly meetings where they bring in successful inventors as well as experts in all various fields that you need to understand to compete in this multi-billion dollar industry. They are free, but you must register to attend. Just go to their website at www.inventors-society.net 
to see their flyer of the month and register. While you're there, sign up for their e-blast to learn about everything from TV show auditions, pitch events, educational opportunities, and much, much more. That's www.inventors-society.net. Then maybe next year you'll be exhibiting in the crazy better than free Inventors Expo. Let's see what they have in store for you.